Hey guys. Hey guys. Hi, I'm Eric. I'm Robin. Wanderboom here with our, our, our very first product review. Review. Yes. And we're doing a double, a twofer. They're kind of related. Yeah. And they're both igloo. Yeah. So in, in that way too. But they're related in how we how we purpose them. So when we were locked down um, in New Mexico, we were trying to think of ways that, how could we stay boondocked if we had enough water, but how could we stay boondocked for maybe even up to two weeks if we wanted to? And for some people in bus life, it's easy. They have big fridges and with big freezers and so they can really stock up on stuff. But our problem was we have our winter fridge and it just doesn't have that much space. You're right, that's even also in regular time. 50 two quart right I think or no so. 62 62 it is a quart 62, so yeah so it's a little bigger than this cooler right which is this is a 52 this is a 52 quart yes. okay so our idea was um the way that we like to eat is um high fat low car um low carb medium protein but to save money we wanted to go to costco really stock up on proteins that are really cheap there and then use the larger side of our fridge as our freezer so that we would have a stockpile of of food, save money, you know, be good. The smaller side of our fridge we would use for our fresh food, but that leaves a lot less space. And especially if you eat a lot of vegetables like we do. So how to solve that problem? Well, we decided, what if we got a cooler and then got an ice maker? <laughs> because then we can fill the cooler with ice if we're out somewhere for a long period of time. Now this ice maker we do not use on our solar batteries because it would use too much power. We would use this on our generator, but we always have gas for the generator and um, it's always an easy way to just, you know, we use it to supplement our power anyway. If, yeah, we, wanted if, to, if we had to make ice, we could just make ice for a while. Yeah, if it's a gray day on. or whatever, we're going to be running the generator anyway. Because, like today, actually. Yeah, like, like today we've got some storms rolling through, so we're going to have the generator going so we can plug the, the ice maker in while we're doing that and make yeah. ice while we're at it. Yeah, plug in, yeah. And so this igloo cooler, we are very impressed with it. It, um, it holds ice for days. Yeah. It says in the advertising four to five days with like at like 90 degrees. And that's pretty accurate. I mean, it's, we, everything is super cold in here. And I have to actually say the vegetables stay much fresher in here than they ever did in the fridge. Um, I think that the temperature with the ice in here, it just keeps it at a certain, at a certain temperature. And, and we have not had any issues with it getting too warm. We drain a little bit. You want to keep a little water in the bottom. The only thing I don't like about it, it doesn't have a rack. And so I double bag and like try and make sure because, you know, water can seep into stuff and that can be an issue. So I hate that when that happens. So I try and really make sure that I that I avoid that. But um, we're trying to look for something like um, some type of a, um, you know, just a grate or something that we can put on so that we don't have to worry about that. Yeah. So watching <clears> for <throat> something that would set in there and kind of. Yeah. Or a rack yeah, that's kind of, yeah. A, so. a rack that would work for that. Um, also did a little bit of other modification with it. Um, it comes with a groove here on top and then a little lip on the on here. And by itself, it seals up pretty well, but not as well as it could. So I actually bought a simple weather stripping uh, that you yeah, use, I mean, people use for you know around their windows and stuff like that. And it has basically it's two sided. You just peel off the tape on both sides, but stuck that in the groove. And now with it uh, over time, it's it's it. It's basically bonded. formed right in there and it looks all, we'll link it in the, yeah, in the we'll description the so as prices change um, and everything. So we but just it has it. a drain. It has a, you know, I like, they're trying to do the little Yeti handle things. It has a drain hole right here that you can drain everything else. Very easy. Handles very are easy. Yeah. The handles yeah. are really good and sturdy. It's very well, well sturdy. Made. Yeah. So and it love even, it. Even has a, a scales on top. So you <laughs> yeah, can measure when you catch that big fish. You yeah. There the, you go. Uh, and measure right on and top. And you can use it as a bench. It's super sturdy. That's right. So the ice maker, um, also by Igloo, also by Igloo. Uh, and just real quick, we are not being sponsored by them. No, we did not no, get no, these no. for free. We bought these on our own. And uh, these are, this is a happenstance yeah. that they both happen to be Igloo at the yeah. same time when we were looking for the same thing. Igloo, well-known brand, good, good ratings, good reviews. So we kind of went with that. So the ice maker, yeah. um, not the fastest I'll, I'll say, but I mean, what, what, what do you, what are you looking for? No. I mean, it's... But I mean, it'll do, it does the first, it's nine little cubes in nine minutes. It's like yeah. every nine minutes, it puts out like nine little cubes. But I'll say is if you leave it on for a long time, it gets really warm. There's a fan that goes on right here. It can be a little bit loud. 
Um, and so I would suggest doing it and having it fill up, turn it off, you know, put the ice in the ice chest or whatever you're using for. The other thing we use it for is cocktails, actually. So if we don't, you know, have ice, we can just make a little bit of ice. That's right. Got some cocktails. And again, officially by it's it's the something something twenty six the saying that it can make twenty six pounds of ice in twenty four hours. If you ran it nonstop, you you got to keep adding your own water to it every so often to mm -hmm. do it. It holds. I mean, it's pretty easy. It's just yeah. it's got it's got its little thing. The ice falls into here. The reservoir is right below there. Holds about a half a gallon see. or so. Yeah, there's a little bit of I'll, water I'll in there. Close yeah. Okay. And then. So I would say um, it works sturdy. Yeah. yeah, it's very sturdy. The the, the motor seems good. Yeah, stainless steel exterior, plastic top, got a nice handle. That's kind of a, a nice thing that I right. didn't notice on some of the other ones. And it's a good and solid and sturdy seems handle. Seems like, like like this is really made well made. Uh, I have to say this igloo, uh, cool. Very impressed. So for us, it's working out well. Um, we still buy some ice, uh, but the thing is, if if we had to. We could, we have this, we could do it. We could make, make our own. If we are either stuck somewhere or we want to stay somewhere for a really long time. Yep. And we didn't want to go travel and get ice or we weren't close to somewhere. Yeah. Yep. So as long as we got gas for the generator, we can always crank, yeah, up, crank out our key. own ice. Yep. Yeah. And it's working out fine. We've been doing this. We, let's see, we left, we got our supplies on June 10th. We have not done another big over shop a month, yeah. since then. Yeah. So over a month, a month and a week. Yeah. And then, yeah, so haven't bought any new proteins, haven't except for eggs and then vegetables. So, yeah, I like how it's working out. So far, yeah. we're giving so, them a, a solid thumbs up. I was going to do, so I'll do some cooking videos coming up and show you what we do with some of the food, if you want, if you would like that. I'd like that. Yeah. <laughs> All so right. anyway, that's our... That's our spiel on the igloos. All right, yeah. And um, so um, real quick, just wanted to also say thanks for the folks that uh, that did link through our uh, our website. Our um, Amazon affiliate, we've been accepted now. Ooh, we are officially uh, accepted so as Amazon affiliates. We got all of $4.79, baby! Gas money. So, uh, so please go back. Uh, I will link both of these products on there as well as uh, the previous, the stuff that was already on there about uh, the refrigerator and a lot of the other things we used. And we're going to continue to add to that list so that uh, as people are, are uh, watching these videos and seeing what we've done, we're going to, now that we've had everything for almost two years, a lot of right. this stuff, these are fairly new. A lot of the stuff we've had for almost two years now. So we can so really tell how yeah, given it whether real, it really works yeah, or not. Yeah, a really good uh, a really good workout to, to find out sure. how well it really works or yeah, not. So, so we're going to be doing yeah. So I actually think those might be actually more valuable yeah. types of than than open the box than out of the box video uh, videos because we've been using it and actually you can see if it holds up. That's right. So um, check the stuff out on our uh, link and please link through there. And again, the way that works too, even if you're not interested in these, if you link through our link. And then anything else you get, we could we'll get a little tiny cut. You know, basically it's like that's how it works. Know, Most people know how like that again, works. Again, that, yeah. that 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 four dollars and seventy nine cents was worth from like three hundred dollars worth of sales. So mm -hmm. again, it just shows the per, the percentage. It's not like we're gonna get rich off this. So just a way to kind of help us uh, supplement the the uh, income a tiny bit and. Uh, and, you know, we help you guys see what works and what doesn't if you're getting ready to join us on this uh, nomadic lifestyle. Or if you're already here. Yeah, or if you're here and you're, you're, uh, you've had a product that hasn't been working for you, you can uh, exactly. we can help out. So it's starting to rain. So uh, yeah, it's raining. Gonna, uh, okay. Thanks, guys. See you guys later. And remember, hey, join the Wanderboom. Yeah, that's right. Come along. <laughs>